Uh, good afternoon, everyone. Thank you all for coming out to celebrate with us today. Uh, my name is Drew Luco. I'm the director of the Motor City Match program. Uh, it is a real pleasure to be here to uh, introduce the 141st uh, Motor City Match business that has opened. Um, this one has been, I know, uh, a long journey and a lot of work. We've been working with Keisha for, uh, for around four years. So we are very excited to do this, uh, very grateful to be a small part of this project. Uh, and I want to uh, introduce uh, the program's champion, uh, Mayor Mike Duggan. All right. Well, welcome to Umi's Comfort. We got a quilt shop right here in the neighborhood. The 141st business opened up under Motor City Match. You think about that, 141 businesses that would not exist in this city. And when we started this program, I envisioned that vacant storefronts on commercial streets would get transformed into businesses. Uh, but what Keisha Esco has done here, I never imagined. She took a vacant garage and turned it into a business. Uh, and uh, whether you want a special quilt made for you or you have a longtime family quilt that you want restored, uh, there is no more talented quilter uh, than Keisha Esco. She is from this neighborhood. She is giving back to this neighborhood. Uh, and if you go to umiscomfort.com, uh, you can see uh, the remarkable uh, quilts uh, that she produces. Uh, and I'm expecting booming business uh, right here on Petoskey uh, to take off not just citywide, uh, but beyond that. So I'm really pleased to be here uh, for the ribbon cutting and to see Keisha pursue her dream. And with that, I'll turn it over uh, to another uh, product of this neighborhood, our great councilman, Fred Durhall. Well, good afternoon, everyone. This is a great day, beautiful day outside today, uh, but more beautiful uh, because we are here celebrating uh, Umi's comfort. Uh, I grew up in this neighborhood, not too far from here, uh, and I can remember what this structure looked like. And as we're here standing here today, it is indicative of what Motor City Match is all about. When we talk about raising entrepreneurship uh, here in our city, when we talk about increasing minority businesses, minority small businesses, or businesses for women in the city of Detroit, this project is indicative of that. Uh, if you know a little bit about Ms. Esco, uh, she has taken her trials and tribulations through life and turned it into something beautiful. Uh, doing what she does here with the quilts. I'm told that on Mondays they have what is called Man Cave Monday. Uh, I look forward to frequenting that uh, and, and learning how to quilt myself. Uh, so that is a promise that we will have. But I'm just so elated to be here today as we look around. We are rebuilding this neighborhood. And businesses like that will help us continue uh, moving forward. So I am so happy to be here uh, today. Uh, I do want her to know, uh, not only uh, are we here to celebrate you and cut this ribbon, but we have also brought an award of recognition for you and everything that you do uh, in our community, Keisha. So thank you so very much. Thank you. And this is for you. Thank you. <laughs> and I believe uh, next uh, we, t we will turn this uh, back over uh, to... Uh, I just, uh, without further ado, uh, want to turn it over to owner of Umi's Comfort, uh, Keisha Esco. All right. I want to thank everyone for coming. Um, definitely Motor City Match for being patient with me um, and all of the con construction that was going on here. I want to thank B Seed for um, assisting me with the zoning of this business. Um, it's been a hard road. But like they say, I have tenacity. I'm a Detroiter. I don't give up for nothing. Right? Um, Umi's Comfort is a business that will help you slow down in this busy time. And it will also teach you how to reverence your ancestors. Everyone in every group has had a quilter. We just have to remember. We use what we have at Umi's Comfort. I can take all the clothes that you have and make a quilt out of it, and so can you. Just sign up for one of my classes. You can come. 
Um, but Omi's Comfort is in the middle of the neighborhood because this is where we live. If you can't have something where you live, what's the point of it? So I want to thank everyone for coming. I want to thank my family for your support. And I want to thank my city for your support that's coming starting tomorrow. All right. All right. Thank you. All right, let's uh, cut this ribbon. Dexter's a high priority right now. Yeah. So I would like nothing more than to be here in the yes. second one. Yeah. 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 Yeah.